Hello and welcome to this reaction of One Piece, the anime. Uh, we are on season one, episode 26, and we kind of left off with Zeph's crew fighting the pirates of Don Kree's crew, and they just beat the Pearl, who's a crazy guy that can shoot pearls and catch on fire. So that's where we're at. Without further ado, let's get to the show, see what happens. We're getting the flashback. Gain! I don't care how much of a badass he used to be. Now he's just a cook. I wouldn't have to break a sweat to kill this old fart. I don't believe that. But you have to leave. What kind of example do you think you're setting for all the other cooks? <laughs> uh, I don't need a lecture from a brat like you. Would you stop calling me names? Quit treating me like a kid! This is crazy! Sanji wouldn't abandon Zeph now, would he? Gein, point that gun at me. Why you? Someone Someone's fed you. eager to die. Lucky for you, I'd be more than happy to oblige. Oh, this Allow idiot's back up. Me. It would be my pleasure to beat you to a bloody lifeless pulp. Every natural pearl! Surprise! Oh, because this, this is Zeph's. Is that old man's life. Yep. I've already taken everything else that man holds dear. His power. His dreams. So while I'm around, I'm not going to let anything else get taken from him! Dream. A dream? Well, I'm going to find the all blue. Then we'll see who's dreaming. That's quite the quest. Good luck. Uh, all right there, little man. Tell me, do you even know what kind of place the all blue is? Yeah, I do. I'm not an idiot. How would people the not know where it is? It's a place where fish from all four seas live. There's fish from east blue, the west blue, the north blue, and the south blue. Okay, enough with the silly stories. Get out there and collect some plates, Sanji. Is it because there's no place where they touch? Because oh, there's man. the line? What a waste. They left behind plates and plates full of this delicious grub. This one's barely been touched. It's pretty good stuff, too. I thought they'd love it for sure. If you ask me, the customers these days are spoiled. It's... Oh! Panicking won't help! Sounds like an attack. Oh, I love that ship. That's fantastic. So, what do you want? Steel. Steel. Those bastards! I refuse to die at the hands of those animals. Shut up! You <laughs> Young to have a death wish, but that's no reason not to grant it. All right, you jerks. If I'm dying here, then I'm taking some of you with me. Oh. Oh. Not here. I, I've got to live. So that I can <laughs> biting his boot. Blue. We withdraw immediately. This storm is way bigger than expected. All right, men, playtime's over. Let's load up the treasure and get out of here. Are they going to end up on the island the same way? Damn brat. <laughs> Captain! Why'd he risk his life for one measly kid? Doesn't matter now, does it? Is that how he lost his leg in this? Isn't a good idea. You're still pretty banged up from the beating you took. What about the ships? Who knows? It 
It was a terrible storm. Our ships were most likely destroyed. It seems we're the only survivors. Washed ashore on a desolate rock without so much as a coconut tree to give us food. Won't help. If nobody comes, we'll just dry up and become two more skeletons in the sea. Skeletons? Really? <laughs> back there. That was neat. It's your share of it. It's some of the food that washed up. It should be about five days worth. Oh, he is bigger. Of course I get more food. I'm a grown man, so I need more to survive than a rat yeah. like you. He's you bigger. I'm grateful that I'm sharing any of it with you. Don't expect any pity from me. Up for 20 days. That's more than enough time to get rescued. I guess all I gotta do now is sit and wait. Easy. I'll make it through this thing. No problem. 20 days. Not what I remember from the live action. That they had nowhere to sit in the shade is impressive. Better than nothing. <laughs> now it's nothing. Oh, he looks bad. Oh. I wonder is the geezer dead yet? There's so much left. He looks so bad. We've got to get that food. It's not fair that he has so much more than me. Besides, this is all his fault. Oh. I came over here to steal your food, old man. Didn't I tell you not to come over here unless you saw a ship? Why? <laughs> you said it's food. Strange, isn't it? We have all this money and yet we're going to starve. Oh, he looks so skinny. For food! You had to have eaten something! Now where is it? I'm talking to you! Answer me! <gasps> what he ate? Ah. What happened to your leg? You old fool! Why do you help me? It doesn't make sense to sacrifice so much for me! Goodness, so he looks so skinny. Tell me! Because... For my entire life, I've had the same dream as you. How many men have lost their lives cursing the ocean, knowing that it will soon be their grave? In that world, this what? This is the first time I've been hungry enough to look death in the eyes. It's always my deepest wish that there be a restaurant in the middle of the sea. A restaurant? Yeah, I was thinking that if I make nice. it out of this mess alive, I'd like to build a restaurant as my final purpose in life. The middle of the sea. <laughs> Yeah, set something on fire, man. Over here! Help us! This way! Please, please! Over here! Over here! Help, help! This way! Please! That old coot. Oh, I hope he told everyone There's the story. There's no way to repay the old geezer for his kindness unless I risk my life for him! Standing, Sanji. That is so very refined of you. But this restaurant will be closing soon. And it'll open again for business as a pirate ship. Nope.
Can't shoot him if there's nothing to stand on, right? Luffy just sacrificed himself right there so that Sanji and the, the old man can win this fight. Goodness. Uh, well, we didn't see Don Kree, so I don't know what's going on with that, but that might be, in my opinion, the best story of all the crew to come together. I love Zoro's and why he's doing it. I still think Luffy's doing it because of... Um, Holy crap. Shanks. Wow. Um, but I, I really enjoy that story, but it, because it shows someone willing to sacrifice someone else just based on a dream. And the kid in return giving up his dream to make sure the old man's taken care of. Right? So they're looking out for each other in their own way and that they have that pseudo father son kind of relationship, which is fantastic. I think it's the best story. But had a lot of like I did for for some reason I did not think they were gonna tell that story. And I'm so glad I gotta see it. It it's different than the live action, obviously, because they didn't do it beat for beat, but the heart of it was there. It was almost beat for beat live action, but now you know why his leg's missing. I just assumed he ate his leg. Apparently he just didn't eat for like a month or two. So Zeph your beast. Um so glad I got to see it. I really loved this episode. Hope you enjoyed this with me. Like, share, subscribe, comment below. And until next time, take care.